Desolation point. Oh, thank goodness I finally found it. Hello everybody and welcome back to The Long Dark. I'm Player Tested. When we last left off, we got stuck down here. I think this is the entrance to Desolation Point. Uh, I was able to sleep for just a couple hours, which was great. Because uh, that... Oh, shoot. Okay. Uh, that was able to at least get me out of the complete and utter tiredness. But I'm not completely, fully slept. Or, or, or... I don't know. I'm not fully rested. That's what it is. Um... So I'm kind of running on borrowed time right now as it is. So I'm trying my hardest to get in there. I was able to get myself all warm and toasty again. So I'm back up to that. Um, so now it's just a matter of, let's check. I want to check in here. Um, of course the radio doesn't work. Why do I even try checking? Uh, yes, a flare. Oh, that works out great. Um, I'm hoping to be able to get through the mines relatively quickly. Uh, to be able to potentially get to Desolation Point. I'm hoping that this is where it takes me. Uh, if not, then I have no idea uh, where to go. Uh, I'm going to have to probably look around or whatnot. But I'm hoping that by going out or going through here, I'm able to get to it. Okay, so we're going to pull out a torch. I'm going to light it. All right. Hopefully there's no wolves in here, because quite frankly, that would suck. Okay. Oh, alright, so, I am really excited, I'm interested in, and in excited to see what they do for uh, a story for this, because this would be kind of cool to, to see what comes of a story uh, for this kind of game. It would be, I mean, there's all kinds of, of things you could do, but this is, I'm interested. I'm really interested, in, and I, I really can't wait for it to actually, the, the story to be released for this, because it would be a lot of fun. So, yeah, right now it's kind of a, like I had said in some previous videos, it's kind of a lull in in uh, games right now. There's not a whole lot of them coming out. Oh yes, antiseptic. We need that. Um, so it's it's. I know that lots of people are a couple people are trying to figure out things to do. Coal. Oh, I know that's useful. I don't need another storm lantern. I already have two. Um, oh, bandages. Sweet. Okay, um, but no, I know there's, I know people are trying to figure out what to play and things like that, and, uh, I know there's, the, the highly anticipated one right now is Fallout 4, uh, which I have on pre-order, um, that I'm really excited to play and, and show you guys and everything like that, which will be fun, um, but... I, as, as far as new games coming out, I just don't, I haven't, I mean, I know there's lots of new games coming out every day and things like that, but I just don't, I don't, I don't really see much of the games that, you know, that strike me as, as, you know, entertaining or anything like that. Now, in that granted, I mean, you guys, if you guys see any of those kind of games, let me know. Uh, just leave a comment or down below or anything like that and, and let me know hey, this is a great game, you should try and check it out and everything like that, and I'll be sure to play it. Because, I mean, there's games I know that, that I'm, I tend to miss that I'm like, hey, this was a this was an incredible game, and so I know my friends have missed them, and I'm like, well, shoot, you should try playing it, because it, it, it was an awesome game. Bookshelf, a soda, I will take the soda. Uh, all right, I think I found the exit. Here's hoping that this exit, a crow's feather, I know those are needed for arrows. So, okay, I'm going to take some of the cloth, because I need cloth for repairs. Hatchet, I could probably use another hatchet, because I'm probably almost out. <gasps> Desolation point, oh, thank goodness I finally found it. Oh, thank goodness. And there was no wolves, this is great. Wow, okay. So, we finally have made it. To Desolation Point. I think 
That's the lighthouse over there. I want to say it is. I'm getting super tired. So I need to find some place to sleep. I'm guessing I'm supposed to go down this way. I think probably the reason why I'm going slow. Yes, in fact, I'm going slow because I'm both, one, tired, and two, <laughs> I need... Uh, actually, you know what? I wonder... I think probably my safest place to sleep is probably... You know, this is the weirdest thing to say, but probably inside the mine is probably my safest place to sleep right now. Alright, so I'm going to set my bedroll down here. Yes, place the bedroll right there. Yeah, that looks good. And we're gonna... How long of daylight do I have left? I have five hours daylight. So we're probably gonna sleep for a good 15 hours. I mean, one, to get all my... all my tiredness. I'll be rest and relaxed. But also, this way I don't have to worry about... Because uh, I know darkness lasts for 10 hours. And I think daylight lasts for 10 hours. Which seems weird, because that doesn't add up to a 24 hour day that only adds up to a 20 hour day I just kind of put that together <laughs> so but I want to be able to go into this fully fully charged and raring to go because I want to be able to oh I hope I can find a rifle and stuff like that that'd be great so all right get some energy back Okay, we're, of course, crackers are probably, yeah, will make you thirsty. There we go. See, right there. It says right in it. Pretty much lasts forever. Well, then, thank you for that. All right. Drink some more water. Okay, we have less than an hour less of darkness. Okay, where is the bed? Bed, bed roll. There we go rest for an hour okay so there is about 14 hours so I'm guessing 10 hours of darkness and 14 hours of daylight so that's great that's that I'm I am all for more daylight because wow that's awesome okay I want to be able to all right, so I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna try to get to that lighthouse. I wanna see what's in the lighthouse. That, above everything else, has, when I saw the the little bit that I did for this update, the lighthouse intrigued me the most. And I wanna see, I do wanna see what the lighthouse looks like and, and if that's an awesome place to, you know, hold up for a while, that would be great. Hopefully, I, the, my biggest thing is I really hope there's a... What was that? I really hope there's a, uh, a rifle in there. That's the biggest thing. I had, I still have not been able to find a rifle. I mean... Yeah, I know. I, I understand that Canada has laws and stuff against you know, rifles and things like that, or guns, but I would think that at least, you know, there would be some type of trapper or hunter, what, uh, that would have, you know, rifles for hunting, you know, and, but, I still have not been able to find one, they are scarce, what is this, oh, this, I mean, Looks like something out of Jurassic Park, almost. <laughs> T-Rex running around now? Oh my gosh, that would be crazy. This is another abandoned mine. This is another abandoned mine. West Access, okay. So I don't have to worry about that. Okay, whew. Um. Okay, there's the lighthouse. I see the lighthouse! Hooray! It's so close, but yet so far away. <laughs> okay, I... Oh. Why do I have an eyeball? Oh, I wonder if that's my tiredness getting to me. That's the thing with being over 
overburdened is is you you get tired faster, which sucks. Not to mention, I gotta I gotta freaking get my clothes repaired too, because apparently, oh, you gotta be kidding me. More wolves, great. Come on. Go away. Get away. Get away. Get away. No, you don't. No. 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 Yeah. Oh, that's right. I have a flare. I have a flare. Ha ha. Get away. Throw it at you. Ha ha. Come back here. <laughs> How? Wow. That is going to be a beast to get to. Not to mention, I've got already. I've already been in a, an entanglement with two wolves. And there's probably wolves walking all over this place. Throw it at them. Yeah. Come on, get it. Pick it up. Take it. Okay. He looks hurt. That's okay. Because I don't want to have to deal with him. Okay. All right. Ooh, my goodness. I think I'm almost there. This is great. Oh my goodness. Okay. I know. I, I apologize right now. Um, <laughs> There is a lot of times I will sit there and I will be talking about something and I I get distracted very easy and so I apologize right now if I say something and I don't finish my thought because stuff gets distracting and I mean I do try to get back to it but there's a lot of the times I forget what I'm talking about <laughs> and so okay apparently all I can do is throw it I can't ex extinguish a flare but that's okay because I'm already here look at this I'm here I don't think there's any other okay so there's some Looks like there's some places over there. The lonely lighthouse. So lonely with the Canadian flag. All right, we're gonna go inside. We're gonna do a little exploring in here. Already there's what appears to be a book, I think. Ooh. Wow, that's cool, it's built into the wall. All right. Cardboard, I didn't get that, so. I don't know what it said. Um, no, don't need extinguish. Come on. I could use this. Yep. Okay. So there's a soda can. There's a book. Cabinet door has nothing in it. There's some more drawers. Energy bar. Wood matches. Yes, please. All right. So far. Nothing really interesting. Book. Let's go upstairs. To level two. Level two has a lovely bed. Some basic gloves. A table. A radio that never works. Some cans of soup. And peaches. Let's go up to level three. There's a newspaper under the bed. There's some scrap of metal over there. I don't need that right now. Let's look in the plastic container. What could be in the plastic container? Nothing! Some more scrap metal. Yes, a flare. I don't need that. Okay. Reclaimed wood, scrap metal. Let's see what's in the lockers. Hopefully there'll be something useful in there. And nothing useful in there. Oh, uh, we'll take those. I, at least I can scrap them. No, don't extinguish it. Force it open. Nothing. Heavy wool sweater, at least I can scrap that. I'm starting to get heavier, which means I'm gonna go slower. Cool. Ooh. Ooh. That's pretty cool. Why does it sound like there's... Why does it sound like there's dynamite going off? 
What? Oh, that's the flare down there. <laughs> oh my gosh, that scared me. Um, I almost thought there was dynamite up here. And that I was just going to explode and die. <laughs> that scared me. Alright. Nothing. Some rounds. Jeez, you'd think that, like... Ugh. That's what that's what bugs me is I I find these rounds lying all over the place, and yet I'm not. That's a boat out there. That's pretty cool. I'm not able to find a rifle anywhere to be found. It sucks so much. All right, I need to light the lantern because I can't see where I'm going. Okay, I mean I have been looking all over the place and I have not yet been able to find a. Uh, what is that? A cherry can? Cool. Um, I have not been able to find a hunter's rifle. Even inside the, um, I was able to find a, uh, uh what's it called? Um, a hunter's lodge. And I wasn't able to find a actual rifle in there either. It's like, well, this stinks. So, all right. Well, anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And until next time, keep playing games, and we'll see you then. Unlocking door number five. Door number five contains more lava, which looks pretty freaking hot. Right. Right. No. Be gone. Be gone. Go away. No. No. Oh, stink. Uh, I... Get away. <laughs> no! No, 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 no!